Every year, uh, there's a Best of Panama competition, which is the Academy Awards of coffee. And um, there are about 50 lots that are auctioned off, and the Best of Panama uh, gets to auction off 100 pounds. Um, and there's uh, usually a clearing price on the best coffee. And last year it cleared at $601 a pound, and this year it cleared at $803 a pound. And we were allocated 10 pounds of, for all of North America. So we, um, we uh, brewed five pounds down in LA, and that's the equivalent of about 40 to 50 cups. And we're doing 40 to 50 cups up here, total. So it's similar to wine, where four years ago people drank Gallo or Almaden, and now they're, you know, talking about different uh, winemakers and different vineyards. So, you know, it might be connoisseurs, but you know, anybody can enjoy great coffee. My mind was a little bit blown about the fact that a $75 cup of coffee even exists, but it was shockingly good. It tasted very different from any coffee I've ever tasted. Would you would you pay $75 for that? I probably would. Would you yeah, really? I would definitely pay. <laughs> you know, like kind of like in a once in a lifetime sort of experience. Yeah, like, yeah, that's fair. Maybe like a fine whiskey tasting. But do this every day. No, no, this no. is not your like Monday through Friday cup of joe. Uh, it's so interesting. When I first looked at it, I thought it would be hyper pretentious and I would think about all the different notes for the coffee, but I was just too busy enjoying it.